okay after knowing equivalent equivalent sets let's uh, subset another important definition of set theory subset let a and b be two sets if every element of a is an element of b then a is called a subset of b and we write this as a is a subset of b this symbol we can use this we read it as uh, a is contained in b a is contained in b is also called as subset of b and b is called superset of a see the a and b two sets if we have every element of a is an element of b you can see this example a is equal to 1 2 3 elements of the set a is 1 2 3 elements of the set b is 1 2 3 4 5 6 then i can say a is a subset of b or a is contained in b anta helbodu yake antandre ella elements of a which we have taken from b in fact andre a b alli iruvanta elements e a nalli na will consider maadkondideve hagagi a is a subset of b also called as a contained in b anta karibodu we can see this uh, another set c also here I have written C as 1, 4, 6. It is a set containing elements 1, 4, 6. It is also taken from B. You can see B is a super set here. The elements of uh, C we have taken from B. So, C is also subset of B. And also we call C is contained in B. This is a definition of subset. And this set is called as super set. Okay. Uh, we have important note. If... Uh, if A is a subset of B and A not equal to B, <coughs> we write this as <coughs> A is a proper subset of B. This symbol is called proper subset. Students, you can observe carefully here, equal symbol is not there. This is a symbol called subset or A is contained in B. But in this symbol, equal is also there. Therefore, all the elements of A is taken from B or sometimes it may be equal to B also. So, A and B may be the same set. But in case A not equal to B, just L, every elements of A taken from B, then it is called proper subset. In this example, A is equal to 1, 2, 3 and B is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. A is a proper subset of B. In fact, A is a proper subset of B because elements A taken from B but all the elements of A and B are not the same. I mean to say A is not equal to B. Isn't it? A is not equal to B. Therefore, A is a proper subset of B. And right, usually a proper word. So, for example, I have 10 rupees in my pocket. My friend asks 8 rupees from my set. I can give him money because even after giving 8 rupees, I can keep 2 rupees in my pocket. That is proper balance I have to give. But if I have 10 rupees, my friend asks 12 rupees, then I can't give 12 rupees to him because I don't have a proper balance. It is called improper. And the proper and the now consider Madiruvanta set A elements uh, B elements in the Kadimera. Say A is equal to 1, 2, 3, taken from B. All the elements of A is taken from B, only equal Allah. All the elements of A which are in B. B nalli adakinta just the elements say Therefore, A is a proper subset of B and the karate. Kutagatala andre uh, A is contained in B, but A not equal to B. Set A and B equal agila, akarana kaginavadana, proper subset of B and the variable. Okay? Because this symbol we just make it a proper subset. Only this symbol we can make it out. Because uh, elements of A is 1, 2, 3, elements of uh, B is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Therefore, in particular, this is proper subset. Even this also uh, is a just a proper subset we can denote. Right? Okay? A is a proper subset of B. C also proper subset of B. Because they are not equal, but uh, the elements of A which are from B. So, one important note. Second, every set is a subset and superset of itself. Every set is a subset and superset of itself. It means A is a subset of A itself. I can say all the elements of A are chosen from A itself. A is a subset of A itself. Superset of A itself. Like if I write the subset of A, uh, first of all you can write A itself as a subset, one of the subset. 
therefore that itself become subset as well as superset in general we can say for is possible it's obey for all kind of sets that's what i have written in examples a is a subset of a itself b is a subset of b itself likewise you can write for all other sets also right if a is not a subset of b then we write it as a is not a subset of b this symbol we can write if a is not a subset of b then we denote it as not a subset this symbol will denote matter for example iga uh, ee case nalli one extra element say uh, 8 add adre then a is not a subset of b because 1 2 3 elements from b but 8 is not there in set b therefore a is not a subset of b agutte got it so uh, this is an example the symbol to, to denote uh, not a subset right the empty set is the subset of every set empty set is the subset of every set pratiyond set in the kuda now subset na collections madvaga empty set is also included so empty set is a subset of every set uh, if a is a set with number of elements m say n of a is equal to m then the number of subsets of a are 2 to the power of m and that number of proper subsets of a are 2 to the power of m minus 1 so one of the very important result just i'll explain uh, with uh, example okay 